Hey boys, welcome back to some more Ashes Cricket. Stephen Smith, career, the return. And uh, we're continuing on with some county cricket action. Have we played county cricket? It's been <laughs> it's been a little bit. I'm pretty sure we've had one one game in county cricket so far. If you look here, Joss Butler for the opposition. I didn't see the other teams. It, it went too quickly. But um, yeah, I think I think we've had one one game. I think it's been ages since I've actually uh, recorded one of these videos. I say that all the freaking time, dude. Because, <laughs> I mean, that's sort of the issue with having like a fair few series going at a time. And that's why I can't remember the video I was talking about, but um, I was talking about the amount of dis different series and probably, you know, trying to not completely cut down everything different, but, um, you know, focusing on a, on a couple and having like maybe one or two different series going because it's, it's hard to... The, I mean, the, the tough thing is, is that obviously I don't do YouTube full time. Um, you know, I work full time and then YouTube... I, I spend a lot of time on YouTube, don't get me wrong, but uh, it is, you know, it is a hobby in the sense of it, even though I do spend a lot of time on it. I, I try to do it, do it well, but, um, it you know, the, the time constraints are sometimes a little tricky to to get up. You know, I, I generally always get up at least one video a day, but it means sometimes a series gets left behind for a few days and then sort of the consistency for each series you know, it gets a little skew if, and then, I don't know, I feel like people probably zone out a little bit, not zone out, but lose interest in a set series if it hasn't been uploaded for a few days, but I don't know, that's just sort of the thing, and it's, it's sometimes a little annoying as well, because I feel like, um, I'm, you know, let, let's say I'm doing a Steve Smith career mode, and then, oh, it's probably, at, at the moment, it's probably more, actually, it works for cricket, because I had... I had a couple going, I had like the batting cream mode and like my spin bowling cream mode and when I was playing like the spin bowling cream mode then I would have to be like, oh I've played like, you know, probably a few episodes of this, I'm going to have to switch over and play some batting cream mode otherwise there's not going to be any, any gameplay for that so yeah that was always a bit, you know, a bit, not annoying but it sort of took me out of one of the others but uh, that's enough inside baseball for a for a minute there, I've already talked about it a little bit, but, uh, you know, there's still, there's still some good variety, obviously, with just rugby league and cricket in general, and obviously, you know, some, some exciting news coming up, um, well, it came out, we pretty much knew, but the official release for Cricket 19, I'm sure we're going to get some, you know, some gameplay trailers, the Academy, demo I'm, I'm sort of expecting that to be released on pc but i don't know i guess we'll have to wait and see and then just you know just more screenshots and more info is going to be exciting is uh they do have james anderson i didn't actually notice that but uh yeah joss butler james anderson a couple of their heavyweights so um got to be a little careful as uh we are you know taking a liking to uh to jimmy here there's a nice pull shot there hit for four you know, he's sort of that, he's, he's a good pace, and the pitch looks pretty flat, so, you know, we can sort of play, play through the line pretty comfortably, as this one's played nicely for a couple there, so moving on to 17 off 12, so we're going, we're going quickly, for sure, but, uh, you know, we're not, we're not, we're not playing recklessly, that's, uh, that's for sure, as well, as uh, that one is, pitch wide and uh we trail by an absolute ton of runs i think there were two 250s in their innings and another another big hundred so yeah it's uh, <laughs> it's obviously a batting pitch but you know three for 73 it happens a lot um in you know longer formats as that is just a belting <laughs> shot good lord that is out of the park 122 meters saw it up in the slot and you know a fairly safe shot when we got to the pitch of the ball on the full just just clubbed it over cover just elegant beautiful shot so yeah fantastic great batting as uh this one's flicked away for a dot but uh what I was going to say, it happens a lot where 
you know, it's a belter of a pitch, but the team that bats first, they get a massive score. And uh, generally, the next team to come out the second innings, you know, the expectations are that they're just going to score big as well, but it doesn't usually happen. I mean, you've been out in the field for a day, maybe two days, and uh, I mean, you're already fatigued, and then sort of the pressure is on that you've got to score, you got to score big, and that, honestly, that's probably the biggest part about any sports is the mental side of it. Obviously, the physical component is is there as well, and that's massive, but everyone that plays at, like, the top level, they've all got the physical uh, ability, right? Like, on their day, they can be maybe not as good as, you know, the best in the world, but they can make, they can make the top graders. That is a freaking unbelievable nut. <laughs> that was unreal. I can't even be annoyed by that one. I get bowled around my legs. Just what on earth? I've played, I played it too late, I guess. I played the wrong line, but geez, what a, what a delivery. <laughs> just, just ripped around our pads. That's, that's unreal. So we get out for 31 of 22. That's not, that's not good enough. Um, and they're going to enforce a follow on. So, you know, straight back into bat. Um, <laughs> we got a little bit of a warm up. So two for 18. We're, we are in some big trouble in this game for sure. It's, it's not looking good for us in, uh, this knockout game. Um, but that was just, that was an unreal cherry. That was just a, <laughs> that was a peach, dude. But, uh, yeah, getting back to what I was talking about, the, you know, the physical part, you know, the top level players, they're, they're you know, they, they got the talent. It's more, it is more the mental, mental part of it. Like, especially cricket, cricket, you know, if you're a batter, like you can just zone out for just a split second and you're gone. One false shot, that's all she wrote. Sometimes you get lucky, but more often than not, you know, if you're, if you're not paying attention, then you're gonna, you're gonna struggle, and, uh, you know, that's the big part of actually being able to, you know, stay in the moment at all times, really, and then, you know, switching off between deliveries and between overs, but when you're, when you're on strike, being able to switch on and, and, uh, fully, fully being in that moment, and, and sort of believing that you're, going to like I'm sure everyone at like you know junior level or higher levels they probably probably everyone has gone through the stage where you you're going out to bat and you you're not feeling good right you're not feeling you may have got a few you know bad knocks in a row like you just you're struggling for form and you, you might be walking out there with the mindset of you know am I going to be able to make some runs like if you're in if you're in a sort of a bad frame of mind to start with, then, you know, just things don't seem to go well. If you go out positively, it's not always going to come off, obviously, and that's sort of where the the more physical and the, the talent part comes into play, but if you go out there with uh, with a clear head and uh, the mindset of actually doing well and, and knowing and believing you can do well, then, you know, that's, that's half the battle, really. Then it's just... It, then it just comes down to if you actually if you actually are good enough to to play really but uh yeah we're uh we're batting along nice that is a, just a beautiful shot it was not an easy shot to play at all back foot drive through the covers absolutely fantastic Stephen Smith he hasn't lost his his touch coming back from a from a long layoff um, but yeah, we're, we're taking a little liking to Jimmy Anderson as Lily is back in where he's out. Oh geez. We're, we're going to be pretty wary of him this innings. I felt in good form. So probably, you know, a little, a little bit, I mean, not even, it wasn't even a risky shot. I just, I just played the wrong line really. Probably should have swept it. Probably, you know, it's a safer shot to one that's, you know, a fair way down leg. Just, it just spun back beautifully. Can't really, you know. Sometimes you just get out to a to a fantastic delivery, but uh, yeah, we need a big partnership here. It's it's looking real bad. Um, Goodleman, Godleman, oh, good lord, what is that last name? <laughs> Myself and Godleman need to uh, really pile on the runs here because we just you know just just put some pressure on. It's right there. I 
That was that was a risky one. I, I premeditated coming down the pitch. He, uh, he threw it a little bit wider, and thankfully I was able to throw the bat at it and get something on it. It hit the man in close, which is good. Is right here. Look at this. <laughs> oh, I had to look at the replay because I was like, "Holy shit! How did that? How am I not out?" So. I thought I might have been out court, but no, it hits us right in the shoulder. And then, as the game does, it sort of glitches out a bit. And they didn't even appeal, so I don't know, dude. That was very lucky, because I know they haven't patched it. Like, that <laughs> that shit happens all the time still. Um, like, I've been running out like that uh, many times recently. So, it's it's definitely not... I don't know. I don't know why they didn't appeal or why I wasn't given out, but, you know, I, I think it's karma, as that is monstrous. 128 meters. That's our biggest six of this career, surely. That is an absolute monster. That was over the uh, the stand straight right there. That was Lily. He's, uh, you know, he got us. <laughs> what? <laughs> what on earth is that dude but he got us out for sure um but uh we have taken to him a little bit here none for 28 off three so we're 31 off 29 we're playing you know with a, a few boundaries we'll definitely be playing conservatively in between the the big shots so we're picking our moments pretty well here i, I feel again i feel con it, and it makes sense i mean we're coming out of steve smith arguably the best batter in the world when he's when he's playing so we should feel confident <laughs> you know there's no reason why we uh we shouldn't come out and play well in these conditions you know it's definitely it's still batter friendly just the the boys have to get around us here and uh and start picking it up because uh we're in we're in dire straits where how much are we behind still i don't even we're probably a good couple of hundred behind um as that is a beautiful shot hit into the gap enough to pick up a very comfortable two that's uh yeah it's just clever batting against the spin 36 off 37 it's it's a it's a defensive field now it's it's a little bit spread so we can't we can't be too um too aggressive as that was again played nicely into the gap a little bit of a tighter two but uh we get back nicely there unfortunately another wicket has fallen slater is a new man to the crease and no that is a big big breakthrough 38 jimmy anderson he's uh he's got us and he'd be very very happy about that one old jimmy so yeah it's just it's a risky shot you know put that away four for 82 just leave that one alone oh that is you know frustrating it's frustrating to play a shot like that and get out in that sense because we we're playing nicely we just had to wait for our for our moment we could have just been a little bit more patient just worked it around still and those yeah short short outside off like playing we did do a beautiful shot for four earlier but it's uh it's a very risky shot so hopefully i don't know hopefully the middle order can can do something here i uh I doubt it. It's pretty good. Slater, he's doing a good job. The tail is uh, is wagging. Massive score. Slater, double ton. Uh, we got him back into bat. I don't think it's going to be quite enough, but the boys, they're, uh, they're firing up. It was not a bad effort, honestly. For the for the spot we're in, to make him come out and bat and have to get 220, like, that's, that's a pretty good effort from, uh, from mainly Slater. Our first innings was just an absolute ride off say to 243 hopefully you guys are enjoying this series make sure to like and i'll see you in the next one